Welcome to the Mobex Institute test subject. You have been chosen to participate in our enhanced mobility test group. Today you'll learn to use our prototype jumpsuit and then we'll compare your enhanced performance to a control group. Just comply with our instructions and everything will be fine. Just duck under the door and everything will be fine. Our previous technician Dimitri failed to meet expectations. He ended up being a test subject, briefly. The suit gives you a rocket-assisted double jump. Jump into the air, then press the jump button to perform a double jump. Touch the ceiling. Climbing is also enhanced. Use double jumps and climbing to get to the top of the giant stairs. See how many power crystals you can collect on the way. Double jump to the far platform. Double jump to escape the pit. Major fracture detected. A complimentary medical station has been provided at the request of the medical system. Help yourself if you need it. Morphine administered. Now it's time to get down. Sprint or jump to gain speed, then crouch, and you'll do a sweet power slide. Power slide under the barrier. Power slide under the door before it closes behind you safely. You can also run on walls. Just jump onto the wall and run to the next platform. Try jumping from wall to wall. You'll notice running on walls is faster than on the ground. You can stop running on a wall by jumping, ducking or coming to a stop. Running on a wall also resets your double jump module. You can combine sliding and jumping to get extra speed. See how fast you can get to the end of this corridor. you're feeling confident. Make sure you've mastered double jumping, climbing, power sliding and wall running. When you're ready, use the button to open the door and we'll move on to something more challenging. Now we'll test your new skills with a speed challenge. Complete the Obstitunity course in under 90 seconds to continue. You can restart at any time by pressing one of the reset buttons, and you can try as many times as you want. Just start when you're ready.
Wow, you exceeded all expectations. You can continue to the next challenge or stay and try to set a good time. The door will stay open. Your best time will be lost unless you have some way to save it. You can use your double jump to survive long drops. There's a fine line between exploding and teleporting, and we're blurring that line more and more every day with the help of our brave volunteers in the exotic energy test group. Brave volunteers in the enhanced mobility test group are advised to stay clear of these beams. Energy Test Group is just where we send our brave volunteers who aren't fast enough for the exogenic predator test group. If you're not sure how to reach the other end, use your human intelligence to think of a way. You are 11% more intelligent than a median rat. The next section is another time-based challenge. The record time is 47 seconds. Try to survive longer than that. Good luck. Watch out for the pain lasers and the toxic slime. Volunteers like you, these beautiful creatures would starve to death. We asked antline expert Dr. Laszlo Kobach for tips on how to survive in a situation. 
situation like this? And he says, you can't be serious, that was your murder. hints about the monster infested death labyrinth but you might want to taste all the weapons and ammo you can find before walking into the monster infested death labyrinth there's just no way to know what you might find in the monster infested death labyrinth i hope it's puppies and soft pillows but it might not be Thank <laughs> you. 